Project Paperclip, importing of Nazi scientists for military Project Chatter, U.S. Navy's research into interrogation drugs. Project Artichoke, neurosurgery for behavioral control. Operation Midnight Climax, spiking innocent civilians with LSD and brothels. MK Naomi, U.S. Army stockpile of various drugs for CIA. MK Delta, governs use of biochemicals, LSD abroad. Enemy of the state, Benjamin Miller, espionage, high treason. He stole chemical weapons research from the CIA. And he plans on selling this research to our enemies. He must be stopped. Sounds like a pretty bad guy. I think we need to go get this traitor. Swallow this pill to select English. CIA badge, special agent. Swallow this pill, I guess, for Chinese. Usually I would take the red pill, but in this particular case, I don't think we want it Chinese, so... Let's get started. Whoa. Close your eyes. Clear your mind. We need you perfect tonight. We believe in freedom. Freedom. Born of the conviction that every person is a child of God and is therefore of supreme worth. For these people, for ourselves, for everyone, we want freedom. The price of freedom. We cannot turn the job over to anyone else. If the United States failed, then the whole cause of freedom failed. January 20th, 1961. Benjamin Miller is a traitor. Miller broke into CIA facilities and stole classified documents detailing U.S. chemical weapon research. If this information leaks to our enemies, the safety of the United States will be at serious risk. Agent Zero, your mission is to stop Miller before he leaks the documents. You know the address. Find Benjamin and kill him. Oh, very interesting. Agent Zero. Cameron Towers, 2168 Olson Street. Building superintendent. All right, so it looks like we are in an elevator right now. And it looks pretty obvious on what we have to do. All right, so now I guess we're in the lobby. Apartment staff only. Let's see if we can go in here. Nope. Benjamin Miller. Locked. Of course it's locked. I don't see a key anywhere. It's a picture of the White House. I bet you the key's under here. Sure enough. Wonder if we can smash this. Ah, yes. women. Only a few generations Looks like a military guy. Of defending freedom in its hour of Two children. That must be his children. That must be him. Maybe that's his it. wife and his daughter. And that's his daughter. I Passports here, obviously, but I want to check out the rest of the room first. What is this? Benjamin Miller, Cameron Towers, Washington, D.C., from Wilhelm Kepler. 
Liberty Circle, Berlin, Germany, is colluding with the Germans. Dear Wilhelm, this is just one of the many documents I was able to steal from Westgate. I will bring the rest with me to Berlin. Oh, so he's heading to Berlin. It's a picture of Kennedy. And on the back, silk cigarettes, smooth and luxurious. Let's see, is there anything back here? Probably not. All right, so let's get to the pertinent information here. This is National Airlines, airline ticket. Washington National Airport, January 21st, 1961 at 4.20 a.m. Destination Berlin, Germany. He's planning to take the secrets and run with it. Yep, here's his passport. United States passport on top of that. Benjamin Miller, January 28, 1911. Wife deceased, daughter Kathy. So, it must be his wife and his daughter Kathy. All right, let's proceed. Enemy target acquired. There's that traitor right there. What do you think? Should we take Eliminate him out? The target. I wonder what he's working on. Let's see, is there anything else around? No. Kill Benjamin. All right, let's do this. Three, two, one. Well done, Agent Zero. Now, one of the documents Miller stole could be extremely damaging to our operation. Recover that document. Benjamin would have hidden it well. All right, so obviously it's not one of these documents here, but we'll get back to these in just a moment. True tales of government corruption. Can we make peace? Head journalist mourns death of daughter. The Washington Post head journalist ben Benjamin Miller has lost his teenage daughter, Kathy, following an unfortunate incident while hospitalized. From everyone at the Washington Post, we offer Benjamin our thoughts and prayers in this difficult time. The Washington Post, with part of it cut out. Union survive political pressure. Union speed legislation in court. Russian increase peace. Treaty? Hmm. That's interesting. Let's see, I guess this guy's a journalist. Yeah, Journalistic Excellence Award presented to Benjamin Miller. Get a little ambient music going there. All right, let's check out these documents now. What do we have here? Dear Ben, I'm worried about the extraordinary claim you've been making following Kathy's death. If the CIA is really doing what you're accusing them of at Westgate, you're gonna need some hard evidence before I can believe you. Please take care of yourself, Ben. I look forward to seeing you once you arrive in Berlin. Well, looks like you're not gonna be going to Berlin after all. Arya, Benjamin Miller. All right, let's see what he's working on. Dear Wilhelm, I did it. I broke into Westgate and found all the evidence to prove what I've been saying. I'm sending a document with this letter and we will bring the rest to Berlin with me. If something happens to me before I arrive, the remaining files are in my hidden room. You can get in by... Well, it looks like something did happen to you before you arrived, but... I don't know, I'm kind of getting the feeling like this guy might have been on to something going on at this Westgate place. Whatever that is. And yes, silks, cigarettes. Let's see, can we have a nice puff of this? Ah, nothing like a silks cigarette. All right, enough of that. I'm deeply sorry about the death of young Kathy. Suicides are always complicated matters. But please be assured that a chief behavioralist, I will conduct a full inquiry. All right, what kind of files are we working on here? Oh, it looks like electroshock therapy. 
Kathy was hospitalized for severe depression following the death of her mother. All therapy attempts have been unsuccessful. I recommend that she be given electroshock therapy and bed rest until her condition improves. Huh. So I guess his daughter was checked into this Westgate psychiatric ward. Wait a second, Westgate is a psychiatric ward? This is getting interesting. Patient intake form, Kathy Miller. Reason for hospitalization, she was admitted by her father, Benjamin Miller. Kathy had fallen into a deep depression following the death of her mother, and he feared she might hurt herself. Observation under the care and behavior specialist, Dr. Henry Angle, who will form a care plan. Westgate Psychiatric Valley Parking. Wait a second. So did this guy suspect something was going on with his daughter? Huh. True tales of government corruption. I'm getting chills just walking around here. All right, there's gotta be a key for that here somewhere. There we go. Dear Kathy, happy birthday. Love, Dad. Let's see what's in here. Whoa. This is the confession of Benjamin Miller, traitor to my country. I am the infiltrator of Westgate Psychiatric, where the CIA uses unwilling patients as lab rats, where the freedoms of the people are paid for by the exploitation of the powerless. I have here Dr. Engel's research files, and I will read out every damn one. Whoa. I wonder where his research files are. There must be a hidden room. That's what that said earlier. A hidden room. A hidden room. <laughs> of course. Whoa. U.S. spies on, are no match for truth drug. Westgate Psychiatric Ward. Westgate Psych receives large grant from CIA. Electroshock therapy for the treatment of schizophrenia. Man claims CIA drugged him and abused him. MKUltra. Heinrich Engel, CIA Technical Services. Ian McGill, CIA Director, linked to James Douglas, Army Chemical Corporation. Larry Standish, CIA Technical Services, linked to the unknown agency henchman. Kathy Miller, that's her. And there's a door here, a cell, and a house. Maybe that cell is inside of that house with that lock. Westgate guard schedule, break in here. Huh. All right, so let's see what's in the MKUltra book. Whoa. Dear Henry, I'm transferring you to our new department project, MKUltra. Your goal will be to develop tools and techniques to control human behavior. You must understand these things before they are used against us by our enemies. Use any means necessary to get it done. Ian McGill. This is a document from Henry Engel to Ian McGill from the CIA Technical Services to the CIA Director on MKUltra. Psychedelics, LSD, psilocybin, electroshock, sensory deprivation. Yeah, that's exactly what MKUltra was. So, I guess maybe she was an MK Ultra. They were doing MK Ultra experiments there and they started experimenting on her and killed her? Whoa, let's see. Dr. Henry Engel, CIA Specialist Services, Westgate Psychiatric, MK Naomi. Oh wow, that's interesting, Colonel James Douglas. LSD, 7,000 milligrams. Psilocybin, 3,200 milligrams. Mescaline, 1,400 milligrams. Scopolamine, 
1,000 milligrams. Sodium pentothal, truth serum, 2,300 milligrams. Fluoride, neurotoxin, 1,800 milligrams. Well, that's why they put fluoride in the water, MK Naomi and MK Ultra. Dear Dr. Engel, we have been testing LSD as a truth serum, but would love to see what other uses you find with behavioral modification. What do we have here? Scopolamine, 1,000 milligrams. LSD, 7,000 milligrams. I wonder if we can take this. No, it doesn't let us. All right, so let's go into these file cabinets. Whoa, another tape. All right, this says confession part two. File 2167, patient was dosed with LSD for 77 days. He is now incontinent. File 2168, patient locked in sensory deprivation chamber, still there. File 2169, subproject 68. Oh God. Kathy. Oh, 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 what has that monster done to you? Oh, I'm so sorry. Whoa. So that must be what's going on. This Heinrich Engel guy has been doing tests on this Kathy Miller at the psychiatric ward. MK Ultra mind control programs. All right. Oh, a UV light. Ben, Mary, and Kathy, one year old. The Tim. I won't lose you, Kathy. More files. Project Paperclip. Importing of Nazi scientists for military project chatter. U.S. Navy's research into interrogation drugs. Project Artichoke. Neurosurgery for behavioral control. Operation Midnight Climax. Spiking innocent civilians with LSD and brothels. MK Naomi. U.S. Army stockpile of various drugs for CIA. MK Delta governs use of biochemicals, LSD abroad. Subject. It's got two symbols there. Let's see. Is there anything hidden? Mind control using drugs and electroshock. Is innocence. Oh, whoa. Whoa, there's a lot more written here. Hold on. MK Ultra started as truth drug research. At least 86 universities and institutions are involved. Neurosurgery and electroshock therapy. Agency funded hypnosis and drug research. Some victims were left with irreparable mental and physical damage. CIA exploit homeless, homosexuals, minorities, and unwitting subjects. Oh, there's that symbol. Price. Dr. Henry Engel, Central Intelligence Agency. I'm writing to finalize our arrangement for the establishment and use of Ward Q at your hospital. Our experiments will be conducted with the utmost discretion on only the most damaged of patients. To avoid public inquiry, all payments will be done through a proxy fund. The agency and our nation thank you for your service in the fight against Soviet aggression. And there's a check here for $97,000. In hidden code, this is the price. Is innocence. And there's that, there's that uh, symbol again. That symbol that's there. Oh, there's symbols on all of these. MK Ultra mind control experiments. She's not dead. Oh, so th he thinks that 
he was experimenting on her and turned her into an MK Ultra test subject. Patients are put in a drug-induced sleep for weeks or months on end. Rear door, prison cells in a psych ward. Truth is down there. Lock for rear door. This is when I can break in. All right, let's go through the rest of these files. The price is innocence of freedom. Monthly progress report, subject, depattering method overview. Subject, again, with that code, that symbol, has uncovered a promising mind control method called depatterning. Electroshock is given in high doses, delaying, destroying memories. Subject is then placed in a drug-induced sleep and played a loop of reprogramming audio. Upon awakening, a subject is given psychedelics and administered hypnosis to guide their actions. That's interesting. All right. What do we have in this final drawer? It's the combination. It's got to be the combination. All right, so what are we looking for? We're looking for 14, 6, and 20. 14, 6, and 20. Just want to look around and see if there's anything I missed. 14, 6, and 20. All right, let's find out what's going on here. 14, six, 20. Kathy Miller, what happened to the flashlight? Let's see if there's anything. Project MK Ultra. October 27th, 1959. I have chosen Cassie Miller, a psychiatric patient of mine, to be my first subject for MK Ultra Subproject 68. Subject's suggestibility makes her a perfect candidate for our objective to create a mind-controlled assassin. Her father and the only living parent will be told she has committed suicide to avoid questions of her whereabouts. March 24th, 1960. We've encountered our first setback. During training, subject caught sight of her unique birthmark, causing a flood of previously repressed memories. We acted quickly to sedate her. This is something we should be mindful of in the future. January Whoa. 3rd, 1961. We've finally succeeded. She obeys without fear. She kills without thought. She is ready for the ultimate test, to kill her own father. This will confirm the readiness of Agent Zero for use. Wait a second. You have done well, Agent Zero. Do you see what you are now? <laughs> I have one more task for you. Burn it. Hold on. I'm Kathy? Go on. You hesitate? What would people think if they read this binder? People would know who you really are. You're a weak little girl who butchered her own father. Yes, that was easy to do, wasn't it? You didn't even think twice. There's nowhere to go. You can never go back. There's only one future for you. Burn it. Good 
Good. Burn your past Agent Zero. Return to Vestgate, Agent Zero. There's nothing more for you here. Welcome back. I am satisfied with your service. You should be satisfied, too. I'll make sure they bandage your hands. And there's something new for you on the bed. We want you to look beautiful for your next mission. Oh, you are such a good girl. <laughs>